Hey guys, since Easter is coming up, I wanted to read you an Easter story. If we were at school right now, we would be making a lot of neat Easter arts and crafts to take home and decorate your house. You can still be doing that at your house if you want. Take some time out of the day to maybe cut out a big oval shape and make some cute Easter crafts. You can draw cute little bunnies. I'd also be reading a bunch of fun Easter books and I'm missing that. So I thought I would read another one for you today and it's called Hippity Skippity Easter. Look at all those fun eggs in his basket. And I see insects like we've been learning about. And it looks like he is taking a walk through a meadow, possibly. Hippity Skippity Easter. I love Easter. And Easter might look a little bit differently this year, boys and girls, but you can still celebrate and have a wonderful weekend with your family, okay? Let's listen to this Easter story. Hippity, skippity, Easter. Do you hear how those words rhyme? Hippity, skippity. Those are fun to say. <clears throat> hippity hop, hippity hop. Easter's here, no time to stop. Hippity, skippity, down the road. With eggs for chipmunk, bee, and toad. Oh, I see an insect habitat. <gasps> what is it? a hive where bee lives. And this book is full of rhyming words. I hope you're hearing them. One for ladybug, one for mouse, one for owl in his green tree house. Boys and girls, look how cute those eggs are. Look, what did he make ladybugs look like? And there's little mouse and owl. He made special eggs for each of his animal friends and insect friends. Hippity high, hippity low. Boys and girls, can you reach up high? Now reach down low. Those are opposites. He's got to go up high to Chipmunk's house and then go down low to Miss Ladybug's house because she lives in the grass or near flowers. That's her habitat. Hippity zippity go, go, go. That's a word that y'all can read. Go, go, go. It's only two letters. G, O, go. Uh-oh, watch out, bunny. Stop, stop, stop. Hippity, trippity, flippity. Flop. Uh-oh. Look at the word stop, and it rhymes with flop. He fell down. Eggs go flying through the air, shatter, scatter everywhere. Oh, no. Boys and girls, how do you feel for a rabbit? You feel sad? I do, too. All of his eggs spilled. What will he do? Do you have an idea of what he can do? Do you think you know what might happen next? You want me to turn the page and see? Okay. So sad, bunny. Boo, hoo, hoo. Not one egg is left for you. Oh, I see another character coming along. Turtle, what do you think Mr. Turtle's gonna do? You think so? Do we have a problem? Yeah. Sniffle, snuffle, shuffle home. Sit and cry all alone. Poor rabbit. But look at his friends. You think they're coming up with a plan? It kind of looks like they're coming up with a plan. They're all gathered together. Maybe they're sharing some ideas. Friends come racing. Hurry, scurry. They can fix it. Do not worry. Scurry, worry, hurry. Look, well, what do they have in their wagon? Glue and tape. <gasps> do you think they're going to fix those eggs together? Let's see. Oh, and what's this? Yarn. A little tape, a little glue, 
Look, everyone is working together. Ta-da! Hooray! Good as new. They put all those pieces together and made one great big egg. Do you think that Rabbit has good friends, boys and girls? Yes, me too. Good friends help one another. Roly poly down the road. Go turtle, chipmunk, bee, and toad. Owl, ladybug, and mouse. All the way to Bunny's house. You who bunny, dry your eyes. Guess who's brought a big surprise? Look at Rabbit's face. Hip hop, hippity hey, hooray. Bunny's friends have saved the day. Hooray day. Everyone is happy and they celebrate together. Hippity yippity, job well done. Happy Easter, everyone. I hope you liked that story, boys and girls. It's one of my favorites to read every year. Happy Easter to you and your family. Bye-bye.